Lexington Mayor Linda Gorton is proposing a city budget she says is bold and addresses pent-up needs building since the pandemic began. Bodie Brooks is here to break down what's inside. Good evening, Bodie. Yeah, Marvin, Mayor Gordon's $460 million budget is a lot bigger than in years past, but she says the city is in a very healthy state economically. The proposal focuses on boosting public safety and creating more affordable housing. Our economy is looking very good, very positive. Headlining the mayor's spending priorities for the future, investments in the city's security. That means more money for One Lexington, a community resource program for troubled neighborhoods, and the addition of 75 flock cameras following the current pilot program. I know when cameras are discussed, people get a little nervous, but these are not surveilling anyone. They are simply taking a photograph of a license plate. Gorton says the city's homicide rate is lower at this point than at this time last year. The budget does not increase the number of officers on the force, but she says these investments give police additional tools to curb crime. If we don't have what we consider safe neighborhoods, we are not going to feel comfortable in parks or we won't want to go out and visit art museums or whatever. Public safety is the number one foundation for a great community. The proposal also directs millions in federal American Rescue Plan money to go towards homeless and affordable housing resources. One new program creates a million dollar neighborhood investment fund for nonprofits. They can apply for money to take this money and upgrade and renovate blighted properties and turn them around for affordable housing. Another reason why this year's budget is bigger, a lot more one-time expenses, like the purchase of a refrigerated trailer and food truck service for neighborhoods without access to fresh food. It will be, if you will, a mini grocery where people can purchase food. It will accept the SNAP uh, from people who use SNAP. Mayor Gordon delivered her budget proposal in an address to City Council this afternoon. Council members will now review and vet the, vet the proposal, adding or removing things as they see fit before formally approving the budget in June. Reporting live in downtown Lexington, I'm Bodie Brooks, Fox 56 News. Also included in Mayor Gordon's budget proposal, a 5% pay raise for non-sworn city employees, money to modernize the city's fleet of fire and police vehicles, a $3 million infrastructure investment fund to incentivize infill projects, a million dollar share in a public-private partnership to bring more ag tech companies to the city and improve existing ones, as well as money to begin commissioning art pieces to memorialize those lost to the COVID-19 pandemic and celebrate the city's 250th anniversary.